Good morning. Hi. Uh, I didn't go here. I'm in the art house out back. <clears throat> Just woke up uh, a little while ago. Olive is still asleep. And uh, I've been trying to paint green screen and get that together. I've been working on it a bit. Uh, it's still a bit too shiny. So it's reflecting all the green screen magic. And uh, oh, I'm having my, having my morning coffee and my morning weed. Um, there's no pot smoking allowed in this house, so I had to improvise and I just drink it now. It's been a really fun and interesting part of our career as clowns, as every time Je uh, December ends, we have to reinvent ourselves and become different people or the same and reevaluate everything because business drops way off after December is over. So we have January, February, and March to decide who and what the heck are we this year you know and so uh we'll be building props and working on new projects and starting new gigs and i'm starting this podcast from back here in the art house because so much cool stuff happens here and i wanted to share it with all of my friends um yeah so it's uh it's gonna be a fun ride it's gonna be a fun new year and uh check this out Kitty. Yes, we're finding other kinds of jobs to do. We're moonlighting right now. And uh, one job we just found, take someone's cat to the vet. Yeah. And this cat absolutely loves going to the vet with us. Don't you, Kitty Kitty? No, she's like, you're kidnapping me. Yes, she's never met us before. Yeah. Well, maybe oh, she has. She's met. But... She but she's always We just scared. went into her house and kidnapped her. So as far yeah. as she knows, she's been stolen from where she lives and she is not happy about it. Yeah. Her... But the good yeah. news is she'll get the little cyst removed from her booty. Cause that's yeah. a big deal, right? That's what she has. She's getting a check. Yeah. The she's... old cyst in the booty trick. And there, we did our best to connect with her before we left, but. Yeah, we read her bedtime stories and she didn't <laughs> give a crap about any of it. No. She's just like, who are you? She, and, and why are you, are you here? Why am I with you? Yeah. And how's she now? Well, the more we talk, the less she talks. Oh. <laughs> but, but it's gonna be. Uh, this is eighty second. This is where your right is, babe. Right. <laughs> I mean, my right. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, honey. Well, We'll get you home soon, sweetie pie. Yeah. We'll get you on a nice uh, stainless steel table with tools and doctors anytime. As soon as possible. I feel like a kid a kidnapper right now. We're a catnapper. But we're you but she's nap, but cat. she's in great hands. She's in really you, You're in she, great paws. She, she she doesn't she doesn't speak my kind of human. She only speaks her kind of human, so yeah. She doesn't know You're that not we're helpful not to kidnapping her, her. Stress levels, huh? Yeah. You don't have. Do you want to call her human mom to have her talk to her? Yeah, maybe. Well, that's what we're up to anyway. Yeah. Moonlighting as couriers of cats. So if you need to go to the cat doctor, that's a problem because you're probably not a cat. <laughs>
son's gonna say, why are you dressed as a bunny, Dad, to come get me from school? I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna dress as a bunny every time I drive. So if there's ever a traffic accident, it would be obvious who was innocent. Clearly the guy in the bunny suit. How could, how could a guy in a bunny suit do anything? Say, do you want a significant other with whom you share food, bedding, finances, have sex with, and potentially raise other humans? Perhaps marriage is for you. Hi, I'm Reverend Dismal and I have recently been ordained. It was such a wonderful experience that I decided to share with you. Reverend Dingo Dismal's discount marriage officiant service. I can perform any legal marriage anywhere in the Portland area and do so in up to one language. Reverend Dingo Dismal's discount marriage officiant service. The wedlock special comes with a song, pronouncement, paper signing and me eating your food, plus unsolicited marriage advice at no extra charge. Now that is value. I'm not the one on trial here. You may be wondering what this service will cost. How do you even pay a clown? Well, to be honest it's a case by case basis. If you are poor then I don't want your money. If you are in a place to kick down the clown then make it rain. Woohoo. Reverend D's discount officiant service. Join the clerk surge. Yay! We're in our kitchen. I'm gonna show you something unpleasant that happened. Got distracted last night and overcooked this pizza. Look at that sad sight. But I'm gonna show you a life hack. I'm gonna show you a good way what to do if you overcook your pizza because you can't eat it like that or it's just gonna tear up your, your mouth still tastes good so we just got to soften it up a little bit and I'm gonna show you a life hack on how to do it right now that'll just take a, about an hour that to do it